Welcome to the commencement exercises for the Maine West High School Class of 2020. I am Dr. Eileen McMahon, Principal of Maine West. On behalf of the staff, administration, and Board of Education of District 207, we wish to express our appreciation for your support of our seniors. We share in your commitment to the members of this class and in your pride in their growth, their accomplishments, and their resilience. Joining us today as part of this ceremony are Dr. Ken Wallace, the Superintendent of District 207, Ms. Sheila Yusuf Abramson, Board of Education member, Mr. Matt McClure, social science teacher and 2020 retiree, reading graduates' names today, Mr. Joel Walsh, English teacher, also reading graduates' names. In addition, I'd like to recognize other people who are assisting us in numerous ways today. District 207 Director of Communications, Mr. Brett Clark. District 207 Coordinator of Digital Media, Mr. Dan Colon. Associate Principal, Mr. David Makovic. Assistant Principals, Mr. John Alworth, Dr. Jennifer Loika, and Dr. Claudia Rueda Alvarez. Our Deans, Mr. Jim Dvorak, Ms. Christina Ramirez, and Mr. Rich Wolf. Fine Arts Department Chair, Mr. Patrick Barnett. Technical Director, Mr. Peter McManus. Next, it is my pleasure to recognize our graduating staff members who will be retiring this year. Mr. Steve Pia, Mr. Matt McClure, Ms. Mary Rolla, Ms. Christina Srutwa, and Mr. David Makovic. Thank you for your many years of service to our students and school. We wish you well in the future. Please turn your attention now to our national anthem sung by Kelly De La Cruz. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watch were so gallantly streaming and What you will hear from this podium today is a revised and probably a shorter version of the remarks I had expected to deliver upon this occasion. I've been thinking of this speech all year and the first version, begun around the end of September, had to do with the sign in the front entrance on the wall with the wood paneling opposite the calf. A display that celebrated a national award for excellence had been there. That was removed at the beginning of your junior year to make room for more cafeteria tables. The sign remains. In case you have never noticed it, the sign says, enter to learn, go forth to serve. I had loved that sign since the first time I noticed it in my first few weeks at West, and I thought it was fitting to highlight it for this class, as you have so many times extended yourselves to serve others. Your teams made blankets and fed the hungry. You packed the bus for the annual canned food drive. As juniors, you ran the largest ever fun fair for children in our community. You collected school supplies and shipped them to Africa. You collected children's books for Toys for Tots. You brought joy and encouragement to another group of seniors affected by COVID-19, visiting from appropriate social distance, residents of several nearby nursing facilities to share your strength and your optimism. I love that our sign links service to learning. As we celebrate your learning today, I hope it is clear that at the pinnacle of any learned person's journey is the wisdom that leads us to ask what we can give to the world before we seek what we can take from it. I thought I would talk to you about how the world needs you, and I wanted to tell you that I think you are marvelously prepared to be agents of and not victims of change. That was in October. Like just about everything else in the world as we know it, this talk has undergone substantial revision. I believe now more than ever that you have within you the power to be collectively and individually a force for healing, reconciliation, and reconstruction. 
What I wanted to say in October about how much we need you feels more intense now, but so does the hope and belief that resides in this class. You are creators and survivors. You are Maine West warriors strong. You are the class of 2020, and no one can take your strength away from you unless you surrender it. This still feels important to say, but it doesn't seem like enough now. Now it feels important to add that what you make of this experience, like any experience, is a matter of the choice between active and passive. At a time when so much is happening to us, and we've been ordered to stay home and wait until it's safe to emerge, and other people decide how things will go, every arrow we can see seems to point in the direction of passivity. Some of you have already seen that this is a fallacy. Some of you have seen that actually, the arrows that will get us out of this instead point to activity. Get up, go help, look outside, find something to contribute. I was lucky enough to read the letters that some of you wrote in Mrs. Klaus's math class to residents of Moorings in Arlington Heights. <laughs> we don't know each other, but I can assure you that you are loved, wrote Nybet. Crystal Ann, who works in a pharmacy, noticed that people's attitudes have changed for the better. Patients have more gratitude and are more appreciative than ever before. It leads me to believe that the world will become kinder. Michelle wrote about picking up groceries for elderly neighbors and wanted to offer good news to the resident who received her letter. She shared this. I was reading some articles to find good news from around the world that I could share with you, and I found one where this man by the name of Haidar El Ali has been planting trees since 2009. As Senegal's former Minister of Ecology and later Fisheries, the 67-year-old was able to rally citizens from the local coastal population to help him plant 152 million mangrove buds by hand, and it created a beautiful coastal mangrove forest stretching hundreds of square miles, one of the largest of its kind in the world. This whole thing took up to 10 years for it to be a full forest again. Isn't it amazing what a person can do? It is, Michelle, it really is. And thank you for what you have planted. You don't need me to tell you that what you do during these times is more meaningful than what is done to you. Activity, not passivity. The people who are looking for what they can do to help others are, I guarantee you, happier than those who are looking for what others will do for them. No one in this class needs me to teach them anything at all about disappointment. But what I can share from my experience is that being disappointed is far, far easier to recover from than being disappointing. As far as I can tell, the difference comes from the choice between activity and passivity. We may make someone angry with active misdeed, but more often than not, disappointing someone comes from not doing something. If your intentions are good and you actively seek ways to help, you are not likely to disappoint. What you do, what you give, will mean far more than what is done to you and what you are given. You can already see that, of course. The residents of the nursing homes who waved at your parade and received your notes of encouragement can tell you, as could the customers at the stores where you have been working, the recipients of your generosity in the District 207 Relief Fund, and the neighbors and relatives you have helped navigate the dangers of this time. This is how you, the class of 2020, have already begun to heal this world. You are resilient, you are brave, you are kind, you are active. You are agents, not victims. You are warriors, and you will always make us proud and excited for what you will do next. We will now hear from three students who have been selected to address their classmates. The first is Anahi Sosa. Hello. Allow me by welcoming you to this year's commencement ceremony for the class of 2020. It brings me great honor to speak to you all as one of the many voices of the senior class here before you. My name is Anae Sosa, and I am beyond excited to talk to you on the deeper meaning of the word conquer. As the last few months have shown us, we as individuals will always be thrown occasional unexpected obstacles in life but we will be able to overcome it. It may be a cliche, but we are on this path called life. And although we dream for clear skies and smooth roads all the way through, sometimes we aren't promised these conditions and get a few pouring storms and fog keeping us from seeing what's ahead. It's easy to feel like we won't see the end of these times, but we will, and we have, as warriors. The summer going into my junior year, I was assigned to read a nonfiction book and write a report on it. And yes, I conquered that assignment. But it's the book's content and message I'd like to share with you all. Cheryl Strayot's Wild, From Lost to Found on the Pacific Crest Trail 
was the reason why I felt like no matter what life threw my way, I would be able to accept the challenge and conquer it. People will say life is a path we all walk, but no one will ever detail what's on that path and how it looks until today. If you are not familiar with the novel and its famous trail, the Pacific Crest Trail is not for the faints of heart. It is a vigorous, demanding trail that stretches across several different terrains and yields for no one. It tests your patience, demands your dedication, and asks more of you when you really don't have more to give. And forgive me for being a realist, but the same comes from life. But there is something beautiful that comes with walking the PCT. It allows you to find your real self through every twist and turn. It shows you that there are difficult obstacles you will have to face, but also shows you the hidden beauty all around you and teaches you to appreciate them. It lets you say you have accomplished something so great and important the moment you step off the path and come out on the other side, smiling. Although most of us probably haven't set foot on the PCT, we all are already hiking, trudging, and moving forward on our own metaphoric one. In fact, we go through several PCTs in our lives, and the biggest one so far has been our high school career. Unlike the real trail, our high school PCT doesn't involve extreme temperatures, jagged rocks, and consuming forests. Our Pacific Crest Trail had entailed losses in, to friends and families, to death, a sorrowful but necessary goodbye to our warrior, and now, in our final few months of school, a world pandemic. But despite these things, we are still gathered here to celebrate all we have achieved, both as individuals and as a graduating class. Having endured these hiccups and many others allowed us to grow and learn from each and every one of them. Every experience taught us inner growth. Each bump, a lesson learned. We graduate today having learned now that being a warrior is something more than just an image. It's a set of characteristics that all of us have grown to possess and be for each other and the school that we come from, teaching us to lead kindly, persist, not give up and embody what a true Maine West warrior really is. You would think that the hardships I listed before would make us back down and from the challenge, but they instead encouraged us to conquer and move forward on our path and go from lost to found on our Pacific Crest Trail. Thank you for giving me the chance to speak to you all today and to the graduating class of 2020 Congratulations on conquering your high school PCT. As we step off this path, let us remember we will succeed wherever life takes us next. And while doing so, we will always be the embodiment of a conquering warrior. Please now listen to the traditional performance of our Maine West alma mater, sung by Logan Culbersh. Oh, hail to the main west whose halls we will not forget we'll cherish the memories the homes and the friends we've met oh sing of its praises and of the days we spent building mind and might Please welcome our second student speaker, Joanna Skorupa. What is so fascinating about the letter X? Most of our parents are Generation X. Does X mark the spot for hidden treasure? Does it mean extra as an extra small or extra large? In our alphabet, being a needless letter has an added invincibility to the tax of spelling reformers. Whether we like it or not, X is simply unforgettable, just like our time here will be. My math teachers have always told me to find the letter X in their math problems, and I finally found their answer. Two X's side by side. No, not two people fighting in a lawyer's office about who gets to take the dog, but two X's that represent 20. 
the class of 2020. We can all agree that the letter X is used in a variety of ways, just like we as a class will follow a variety of paths throughout our lives. Some of us will pursue higher education across the country, others will stay home. Some of us may enter into the military, and some of us may enter into the trades. But as we depart into our own individual lives, we will always have a tie back, a common thread right here to Maine West. Although Maine West has not been the school I attended throughout my entire high school career, I was greeted to, with open arms to the most spirited community I have ever met in my life as soon as I walked through the doors. Although I knew a few of you from grammar school, Maine West has allowed me to create endless memories that will be engraved in my brain forever. Warriors truly do bleed blue and gold every single day. I'm not going to lie, I wasn't exactly happy to change schools in the middle of my junior year, but it ended up being the best thing that has ever happened to me. Maine West has given me new friends, a new family, and a new home. I am beyond proud to graduate beside my fellow warriors here today. And no matter where we end up in the next few years of our lives, we will all be intertwined by the bond of high school, truly one of the only things in life you get one chance at. As Malcolm X once said, education is the passport to the future, for tomorrow belongs to those who prepare for it today. Warriors, this experience has been another stamp in your passport, so go confidently in the direction of your dreams and live the life you've imagined. Thank you and congratulations to the class of 2020. It is now my pleasure to introduce five members of this senior class who have earned the status of Maine Scholars. Through their academic achievement, these students constitute the top 1% of their graduating class. This year's Maine Scholars will receive a blue and gold stole and a gold medallion in accordance with Maine West tradition. Our Maine West High School Class of 2020 Maine Scholars are Olivia Bitkan, Ashwini Modi, Malika Zaidi, Driti Patel, Laura Okrezik. Congratulations on your outstanding achievement. Our third speaker this morning is Maleka Zaidi, who has just been recognized as a Maine Scholar. Please welcome Maleka to address the class. Before sitting down to write this speech, I spent a lot of time thinking about what it was that I would be saying before you all today. After a while, I realized that this speech was not meant to be perfect. It would be anything but, because that's what our past few months have been. Before I talk about that, however, I'd like to talk about our past four years at Maine West. We walked in as freshmen, terrified by the thought of high school. Now, we're not willing to let go, tearing up at the thought of even leaving high school. We're not the same youngsters that walked in. Instead, we are adults who are being set free into a world of possibilities. These past four years have fostered continuous growth, leaving us with lessons and memories that we will cherish for years to come. Never did we dare to think that March 13th would be our last day of high school, yet it was. The sacrifice that we made, however, was crucial to maintain the safety of others. We did our best to help protect those around us, and unknowingly, we brought to life what it truly means to be a warrior. We show up and we help those in need, whether it be something as simple as helping our neighbors with their groceries or something as big as trying to contain a global pandemic. We have shown true strength, able to rise in solidarity in a time of such uncertainty. We have shown selflessness, willing to put others before ourselves to ensure that everyone is protected. We have shown humanity. The glory in our journey is our ability to rise after we fall, our ability to tackle any obstacles that come our way. One of the most important lessons that we take away from this journey is the reminder to never take things for granted. The thing you told yourself you'd do tomorrow, do it now. It is this lesson that we shall carry with us for the rest of our lives. Live every single day to the fullest and go to sleep without any regrets, for you never know what life will throw your way. Over the past four years, all of our teachers encouraged us to be the light of joy in the lives of others. And might I add on, don't hold back that light for any reason, shine it. Class of 2020, I cannot wait to see the amazing things we all will do. Congratulations. Now please welcome our superintendent, Dr. Ken Wallace, who has some words for the class of 2020. Dear Maine West, class of 2020, Roman philosopher Seneca wrote, it is not that we have a short time to live, but that we waste a lot of it. If this year's pandemic has taught us anything, it should be that we should seize every moment we have to connect in person with each other to lift each other up and to make the most of the moments that we have. 
This year is one like no other in history. Despite the losses of traditional events like in-person graduations, proms, and senior honor ceremonies that we all recognize are missing, I encourage each of our graduating seniors to reflect on the things that we have gained this year, for sometimes it is in the loss of something that we truly appreciate the value of greater things. What are those greater things? A hug from a friend, a kiss from our grandmother, a laugh with our teacher, a moment of shared sadness, or joy surrounded by friends. These moments may often seem small until they are taken away. What the class of 2020 will have is history and the knowledge that no matter what happened in the world, we adjusted, we learned, we survived, and we came out better in the end. Above all, let's rise to the essential challenge that a Maine Township High School District 207 education provides to be a learner. Never afraid of the future or difficulties, but capable in every moment to adapt, solve, survive, and thrive in any circumstance. Someday you will tell your children or friends about this year and the profound impact it had on you and your classmates. But in telling, never forget the lessons you learned and the bounce in your step the first moment that the re world returned to its former self and you knew gratitude in a way that you never had before. I could not be more proud of a class of graduates than of the Maine West class of 2020. Thank you. At this time, I am honored to present the class of 2020. This class of 542 seniors has made a powerful impact on the lives of their fellow students and the faculty and staff of this high school. They have imprinted indelibly upon the ongoing legacy of Maine West High School in the following ways. In academics, 44 seniors have been recognized as Illinois State Scholars. 26 seniors earned top 5% recognition. Three seniors have been named National Merit Commended Students. One senior, Olivia Bitcon, earned National Merit Semifinalist status and subsequently became a finalist, Maine West's first since 2017. One senior has been named a Gates Scholar. This was the first class in our school's history to enroll in AP World History as freshmen, setting the standard for engagement and achievement that other classes must stretch to follow. Furthermore, our seniors have been inducted into numerous honor societies, 81 in National Honor Society, 41 in Spanish Honor Society, 134 in Pi Sigma Pi, the Social Science Honor Society, 65 in the National English Honor Society, 12 in the National Art Honor Society, 46 seniors are members of Mu Alpha Theta, the Mathematics Honor Society. In publications, the seniors in this class have led their staffs on the Westerner, the Legend, and Westwards to produce high quality publications that chronicle student life and achievements at Maine West. Senior editors on the Westerner led one of the largest staffs ever at 37 and accumulated numerous awards, including a national first place recognition by Quill and Scroll for in-depth reporting and a first in state recognition for feature writing. Five seniors, including one editor, led the legend to produce yearbooks that unite Maine West warriors for years after they leave high school. Four seniors led a staff of 10 in the production of Westwards, a literary arts magazine offering creative warriors the chance to share their voice with their classmates. In athletics, there may be no group of seniors who have led Maine West athletic programs to more success than this group has. In what is arguably the most successful four years of athletic competition in the history of Maine West High School, your class has secured at least one CSL conference championship in girls basketball, boys basketball, girls water polo, boys water polo, girls volleyball, football, and softball. Multiple baseball regional championships, as well as the well-documented regional, sectional, supersectional, and state honors won by our girls basketball program. This group of senior girls basketball players never once lost a CSL conference game, going 40 and 0 in their four years. In addition to the conference success, the girls won an IHSA Girls Basketball Regional and Sectional Championship in each of their four years. They won a third place trophy at the IHSA State Finals and went 35 and 0 and won an IHSA State Championship. This class also contains our first ever McDonald's All-American and Ms. Basketball of Illinois, Angela Dugalich. This class had by far the most successful run of football success in school history and shattered countless records. They secured three consecutive CSL football titles, qualified for the playoffs for three consecutive years, and won an IHSA state playoff game, 
all firsts in the history of the Maine West football program. The class of 2020 secured a Central Suburban League girls and boys water polo conference championship in each of the seasons they played. While they didn't have the opportunity to defend their championship this spring, their six conference titles in the three years in which we could play CSL water polo highlight the best run in school history. Three members of this class have been named All-State in their respective sports. Ray Yuri for diving, Jaden Dolphin for football, Angela Dugalich, basketball. Five seniors in this class were state qualifiers in their sports over the last four years. Ray Yuri, three times in diving and once in cross country, Aliyah Bilotic and Katie Hudson for badminton, Angela Dugalich, track and field, David Roscoe, bowling, Taylor Anama, Special Olympics bowling. Three seniors have performed with distinction in Special Olympics in bowling, track and field, and snowshoe. Seniors in this class in all their sports earned 134 CSL Scholar Athletes Awards for GPAs of 3.0 and higher. They earned 93 IHSA Scholar Athlete Awards for GPAs of 3.5 or higher. In the arts, the creativity and dedication of our seniors over the last four years has enriched our lives through our ears, through our eyes, and through our hearts. Members of our broadcasting classes and WMTH won several awards from the National Academy of TV Arts and Sciences, including a Crystal Pillow Award for Animation and a Fifth Place Award for News Production. Our visual artists submitted to and were selected to display their work in the Illinois High School Regional Art Exhibition. The West Side Dance Company has been selected for the Student Choreography Showcase of the Illinois State High School Dance Festival for three years in a row. Senior musicians were selected for the Illinois Music Education Association District 7 Senior Festival. For their contributions to school and community, the members of this class have extended themselves time and again to make West better. 38 seniors, including four commissioners, became part of our first ever link crew, devoting time and counsel to freshman students, guiding them through their first year as Maine West Warriors. Members of accounting club prepared tax returns for community members, yielding hundreds of dollars in refunds. Class council organized homecoming, junior prom, and the powder puff tournament, in which the class of 2020 won this year in epic fashion. Key club collected for the food pantry, made snack bags for Special Olympics, and volunteered at Feed My Starving Children. DECA had two seniors place at regional competition and 11 senior members of the team overall. Four members of Skills USA, an engineering team, placed at the regional competition and advanced to state. The mock trial team had their most successful year yet, hosting the largest tournament in the state and seeing five seniors recognized as outstanding attorneys and three seniors recognized as outstanding witnesses. Culinary Arts Club donated $1,000 to the District COVID-19 Relief Fund and had three qualifiers at state competitions. Student council packed the bus for the food pantry, collected Thanksgiving letters for troops serving overseas, and resurrected movie night as part of our homecoming celebrations. And last but not least, I should also note that were it not for the class of 2020 and their trademark boombox, Mrs. Maria Ward, one of last year's interim principals, would likely have lived the rest of her life without ever learning the lyrics to Mo Bamba by Mr. Sheck Wes. In recognition of their effort, their achievement, their love of our school, and their perseverance through notable challenges. Ms. Yusuf Abramson, Dr. Wallace, it is with pride and joy that I present to you the Maine West High School Class of 2020. I certify that the graduating Class of 2020 has met all the requirements as set forth by the State of Illinois and the Board of Education of District 207, and are hereby granted all the rights and privileges that correspond accordingly. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce Board of Education member Ms. Sheila Yusuf Abramson to accept the class. As we virtually gather today, I want to thank all of you, seniors, teachers and staff, families and friends, for pulling together these last couple of unprecedented months to collectively ensure that our seniors would be ready to present today for their graduation, as they all are right now in this very moment. You all have reflected the very best of our Maine West and District 207 community, especially each and every one of you seniors. And while this is not the graduation you imagined, this is the moment that you absolutely have earned. And we could not be more proud of you. So seniors and students, please join me first in recognizing all the hard work and dedication that your parents have provided 
which has helped you to get to this day. Please also join me in recognizing the great teachers and staff of Maine West High School who have dedicated themselves to making today possible no matter what it took. Our schools are, and always have been, about learning and learning environments. We as taxpayers strive to provide you with the greatest quality education that is available. To that end, I believe that we have engaged the best possible faculty and staff for your education, which truly was reflected in the way they quickly stepped up and adapted to e-learning teaching while also staying connected to their students this past semester. And finally, parents, staff, friends, and guests, please join me in saluting our seniors and letting them know how proud we are of them for the strength and resiliency that they have shown through the past semester, for graduating today and moving on to the next chapter of their lives with the dignity and optimism that they have shown not just in the last couple of months, but during all four of their years at Maine West. Seniors, you are amazing, and we wish you the best success with your future. Principal McMahon, on behalf of myself and the rest of the Maine Township High School, District 207 Board of Education, it is with the deepest honor and warrior pride that I accept this amazingly resilient and strong graduating class of 2020 and certify them as eligible for graduation. Thank you. At this time, we will begin conferring the diplomas. Mr. McClure and Mr. Walsh, we are ready to present the diplomas. As Mr. McClure and Mr. Walsh read the names of our graduates, please note that the first nine names represent student council members and senior class officers. Thereafter, graduates will be presented alphabetically. My name is Matthew McClure. I'm a teacher in the social science department. And this is my 33rd and final graduation from Maine Township High School West. Congratulations to the class of 2020. My name is Joel Walsh. I'm a member of the English department. And I am happy and proud to join you, the seniors of the class of 2020, and your families today. Lacey Bell Argus. Aliyah Grace Bilutich. Kimberly Marie Fairhead. Daniel James Kenshin. Susanna Rosalia Linick. Laura Ashley Okrezik. Kinsey May Reeves. Clara Ann Sorensen. Nicolina Vojcic. Majid Essa Ablahad. Ula Wasimilor Adeseo. Faiza Hassan. Amir Hassan. Emmanuel O. Ajuze. Meltem Aksoy. Lena Fenice Albo. Guadalupe Avalos. Alcaraz. Dorothy Nicole Alejandro. Brianna Natalie Altamirano. Uganbayar Amar. Ugan Balor Amar. Taylor. Rhyme Anama. Catherine Elaine Anderson. Joseph Thomas Antosh. Yesenia Aparicio. Kristen Marie Aragon. Ashley Arias. 
Daniela Aristillo. Samuel James Arnold. Axel Arzola. Elena Avila. Golner Aitken. Miriam Babinska. Erica Babinska. Samantha Bahena. Dor Becker. Cedric Sampang Balange. Jeanette Diane Balanit. Caroline Kirsten Barnett. Stephanie Nicole Barnhart. Jonathan Angel Berrigan. Michael Bartusiak. Aja Chanel Bass. Daniel Matthias Baumhart. Crystal Ann Barreckus. Bibin Bijou. Olivia Rose Bitcon. Morgan Marie Black. Liam Bo Blackburn. Kevin Scott Bojarski. Sarah Grace Borgman. Nicole Bortnowski. Andrea Isabella Bottas. Zoe Balamatsis. Kamoni Boyd Brown. Liana Bravo. Graciela Breton Solano. Lindsay Abigail Brito. Peter Paul Brazda. Nathaniel Spencer Briars. Darcy Buchanan. John Lineal Gumapak Burgos. Victoria Sarah Bushak. Amanda Marie Byrne. Carlos Calcano III. Fabiolo Calvillo Flores. Joseph Russell Cangelosi. Paige Christine Capasso. Viri Diana Carvajal. Ashley May Carlino. Matthew Abram Carrasco. Andre De Los Santos Carrillo. Eduardo Carrillo. Jessica Casillas. Meg Casipo. Caesar Castaneda. Glenda Seha. Salvador Seha. Julio Caesar Changala Zolio. 
Esmeralda Chavez Zapeda. Nayeli Chavez. Manuel Alexander Chavez. Lily Chen. Cheyenne Ashley Chiro. Benabal Jamil Chamun. Yamalith Sinfuegos. James Vegas Class. Antonio Rafael Co. Sean Patrick Collins. Olivia Maria Collins. Daniel Michael Keneally. Stacy Ann Connor. Rodrigo Contreras. Alejandra Contreras. Angel Contreras. Lisbeth Contreras Sanchez. Kyle Christopher Conway. Demarion Trevon Prince Cooley. Aliyah Marie Corona. Christian Gustavo Correa. Jonathan Cortez. Esteban Cortez. Alex Cruz. Ashley Cruz. Camila Cruz Granados. Brian Cruz Machado. Gidi Cruz Rodriguez. Kevin Jacob Cuellar. Benjamin Thomas Curtis. Liris Elvira Daker. Elisa David. Shannon Eileen Davis. Eduardo Delora Cruz. Angela Beatrice Del Rio. Kelly Ann Dela Cruz. Giovanni Jeremiah Delau. Zara Amber Dervovic. Zaida Marie Diaz. Noel Ariana Diaz. Olivia Louise Diaz. Alejandro Diaz. Dennis Dizderovich. Jaden Alexander Dolphin. Frank Joseph Drews. Clara Lillian Ducharme. Raul Duarte. Natalia Victoria Duda. Angela Dugalich. Jesse Duran. 
Ariana Duran. Alyssa Esperanza Duty. Carter Richard Dvorak. Joseph Dylan Ingle. Cassandra Espinoza. Jonathan Espinoza. George Espinoza. Valerie Kristen Etzweiler. Blaze Eslakowski. Rosalia Martina Ferraron. Fabio Eduardo Felix Godina. Samantha Constance Bastoso. Coral Fierro Chavez. Casey Ann Fitzgerald. Matthew Fleener. Sarah Forstek. Olivia Forstek. Patricia Forstek. Michael Framke. Daisy Franco Cortez. Justin Stephen Franco. Philip Gatza. Angie Montserrat Galvez. Sengel Gensorig. Julio Ivan Guiana. Catalina Garau Fry. Ivan Garay. Miguel Garcia. Angelina Maria Garza. Ethan Andrew Giovanni. Lucas Jeffrey Glaster. Lexani Xavier Gomez. Melissa Yanira Gomez. Yaselin Gomez Gomez. Thomas Stewart Gray. Gladys Aureli Gregorio Morate. Riley Walter Griffin. Andre Dimitrov Grigorov. Allison Marie Grimm. Brittany Elise Grundy. Anthony Grika. Ashley Alicia Guapa. Emiliano G. Guerra. Cesar Guerrero Gomez. Anthony James Gutierrez. Hannah Lisa Gutstadt. Jennifer Guzman. Bismarck 
Kwame Gaibi. Peira El Halabja. Khalil Hall. Amanda Page Hall. Stephen John Horayo. Kyle Liam Harrington. Zachary Calvin Xavier Harrison. Skyler Ann Hawkins. Xiao Lin He. Caitlin Faith Heimbach. Jack Joseph Hernandez. Hector Hernandez Acevedo. Giselle Herrera. Julia Marie Heslin. Jacob Isaac Heyman. Danielle Kathleen Heise. Catherine Marie Hudson. Alexis Huerta. Lionel Huerta. Griffin Joseph Hutter. Ian Thomas Hupp. Omar Katab Hussein. Olua Tobalobala Aduni Ianda. Dominic Jablonski. David Jackson. Kevin B. Jacob. Stephine Samir Jaju. Camille Jasinski. Marco Jimenez Garcia. Jordan Andrew Johan. Ellie Ann Johnson. Cantrell Trevon Johnson. Javon Therese Johnson. Ruth Jolds. George Cuddy Joes. Sona Hosman. Heta Joshi. Alexis Helene Jerzek Stoser. Jacob Robert Jushik. Jonathan Kang. Joseph Roman Kapolanski. Arif Karim. Adrian Karwowski. Sophia Page Katsikaras. Jason John Camel. Ashir Mohammed Khan. Ibad Khan. Jenny Kayel.
Matthew Alexander Kurzmian. Logan Elizabeth Kalbersch. Sadie Leola Kunz Hales. Emily Babu Curian. Christopher Lara. Peter Azarevich. Whitney Lee. Myla Alexia Ledesma. Andrew Leon. Luis Leon Reyes. Kevin Francis Letts. Serhi Stefanovich Lichner. Michael Charles Lindenmuth. Michael Liston. Jocelyn Lopez. Jorge Lopez. Patricia Lopez. Edgar Francisco Lopez Serrato. Ronan Rafael Desena Lorenzo. Rita Leslie LaSalle. Renee Ariana Lowe. Natalia Nabil Lucas. Hannah Elaine Lund. Carlotta Maria Luisa Macias. Joel Magana Conte. Michael Vincent Makic. Alicia Andale Maldonado. Alexandra Malavich. Giovanna Marie Mando. Adrian Markowski. Jose Alexis Marquez Mendoza. Claudia A. Moran. Michaela Ryan Marakin. Selena Christina Matias. Jose Miguel Maya. Jose Saul Maya. Ava Sebastian McKenzie. Isabel Mejia. Theodore G. Meladonas. Nabet Mendoza. Ryan Thomas Merlin. Brianna Nicole Megajewski. Savannah Rose Miller. Abigail Reina Milovansanovich. Jacqueline Miranda. Alexis Sherry Mitchell. Jacob Wojcic 
Midgard. Urban Moalam. Ashwini Umesh Modi. Dev Modi. Michelle Matahano. Jared Derek Moore. Cesar Morales. Edwin Morales. Karina Moreno. Jocelyn Moreno Rivera. Claudia Rose Morrison. Jacob Christian Moshevich. Lexi Marie Matter. Abrar Mubin. Yasmin Muniz. Noe Aaron Munoz. Valeria Alexia Murillo. Daniela Maria Murillo. Jalen Brian Murray. Victor Maitich. Nikita Nali. Christopher Nava. Ishmael Nava. Andre Mariusz Nyaksu. Colleen Gwen. Nicole Marie Nidzielski. Kara Lena Duwinski. Rodney Njoku. Zachary Tyler Norman. Haley Margaret Nowagurski. Catherine Osaguera. Isaac Mariano Ochoa. Aliyah Francis O'Connor. Caesar Oleo. Grace Charlotte Olson. Emmett James Olson. Alejandro Olvera. Emily Ray Orstrom. Claire Elizabeth Padar. Kevin Padilla. Edwin Alexander Plasios Torres. Nico Gamayon Pancho. Anne Jasmine Panjiban. Dridi Patel. Rutu Trushit Kumar Patel. Pujan Patel. Ashvi Hamansu Patel. 
Pravil Kumar Patel. Keisha B. Patel. J. Patel. Jacqueline Patino. Ruby Patino. Raju Pucci Pedada. Michael Eduardo Perez. Daniel Perez. Julio Perez Negron. Anastasia Perrick. Sky Kathleen Payton. Ansa Anna Phillip. Eric William Flager. Jonathan Tyler Picciotti. Marlena Felicia Perch. Haley Madison Posada. Kyler Eric Polovchuk. Deanne Francis Denura Porimba. Tyler James Posh. Yas Jacob Prisbilowitz. Jose Luis Quintana. Rianne Rasat Ray. Velen Ramirez. Daniel Ramirez. Erica Ramirez. Raul Ramirez. Salvador Ramirez. Joshua Patrick Clavel Ramos. Jonathan Real Corona. Paola Real Velasquez. Nicholas Dimitrios Vacunas. Alexandra Runu Orlandini. Anthony Jetzel Reynoso. Jaime Rico. Jacob Jordan Riedel. Michelle Amy Rahani. Sky Josephine Cassidy Risden. Eduardo Rivera. Jonathan Miguel Rivera. Jack Joseph Roback. Jenna Paige Robbins. Michelle Robles. Lionel Rodea Ramirez. Armando Rodriguez. Elizabeth Rodriguez. Theodore Daniel Rodriguez. Francisco Rodriguez. Maribel Rose Rodriguez. 
Melissa Rodriguez. Zamara Rodriguez Fuentes. Alvaro Manuel Rodriguez Reyes. Olivia Agnes Rogue. Samantha Roldan. Elizabeth Roman. Maria Concepcion Romero. Jennifer Romulo. Osvaldo Rosas Pachuca. David James Roscoe. Andrew James Ross. Yolianette Royal. Gabriel Roman Rusecki. Daria Azniska Rik. Samantha A. Ritt. Rahil Sudradin. Homam Safaf. Devanjeet Singh Sani. Sumit Singh Saini. Jocelyn Ariana Salas. John Vladimir Saluta. Liliana Nicole Sanchez. Gloria Sanchez. Margarita Sanchez Garcia. Benjamin Dean Sanfilippo. Amaris Santos Cruz. Alexis Jared Santos Melkor. Christina Marie Savarino. Andrew Daniel Shackey. Benjamin Robert Schalke. William Andrew Shirtler. Kevin Patrick Schill. Sydney Francis Schroeder. Sabrina Francesca Scola. Gabriel Scott. Jocelyn Joseph Kapungan Sebastian. Madeline Elizabeth Sebastian. Ricardo Alejandro Selvas. Brennan Daniel Sender. Jasmine Sepulveda. Jasmine Servan. Kristen Elizabeth Sevchuk. Ashi Devang Shaw. Rohan Pradish Shaw. Abdullah Mohammed Sheikh. Saruddin Mohammed Sheikh. Isaiah Miguel Syme Davis. 
Louis Seguere. Joanna Scarupa. Sarah Smale. Aaron David Smea. Lauren Haley Subject. Taylor Rose Subject. Sebastian Solars. Daniel C. Soriano. Anahi Sosa. Anthony Springer. Lauren Ann Staunton. Hilton Edward Steele. Jessica Lynn Steingard. Jared William Stevens. Peyton Leanne Sturgeon. Bariba Sultani. Sam Giovanni Suriano. Haley Alexandra Swalski. Hassan Syed. Dominica Shaw. Angelina Kiliana Dow. Marlene Tapia. Dakota Edward Temple. Justin James Thalican. Jalissa Alberta Thomas. Isabella Skye Thompson. Jacob Matthew Tibet. Brianna Torres. Angelica Dilcia Torres. Alejandro Torres. Jasmine Kellis Torres. Vanessa Torres. Mark Anthony Toscano. Adrian Trejo. Daniel Trejo. Rebecca Troncoso. Melissa Victoria Trujillo. Alex Joseph Turner. Ryland Marcus Turner. Sophia Turner. Raymond Norman Yuri. Jocelyn Michelle Uribe. Zaid Abdallah Uzman. Ashley Haley Linda Hui. Miriam Daniela Vavalez Martinez. Jacinth V. Valera. Elizabeth Vallejo. Dylan Elizabeth Van Fleet. Marcus Benjamin Varga.
Willie Vargas Velasquez. Vanessa Vasquez. Antonio De Jesus Vega. Angeline Velasquez. Andrea Velez. Cecilia Rose Virgil. Felipe Amezcoa Victor. Natalie Victor. Brianna Evelyn Vieira. Miguel Viegas Flores. Carl Angelo Carrillo Vesperas. Maximilian C. Wagner. Everelli Walker. Sebastian Sylvester Wakosh. Brandon Michael Walski. Teresa Judith Waston. Caitlin Rose Weber. Emily Aaron Wipert. Nicholas Andrew Wena. Chloe Rose White. Ashanti Talaya Williams. Dante Christopher Williams. Taylor Williams. Margaret Maria Wood. Christian Joseph Wooten. Sarah Jeanette Wooten. Joseph Michael Wright. Tiana Marie Innocencio. Zophelia Caitlin Yost. Aisha Zabi. Malika Saida Zaidi. Fernando Zaldivar. Alejandro Zarco. Monje Hope Alexandria Zabinski Alexandria Zendejas Congratulations to the entire Main West class of 2020 Graduates at home if you are wearing your caps please move your tassels from the right side to the left side, now that your diploma has been presented. Maine West Warriors Class of 2020, you have now officially graduated. Wherever you are, whenever you watch this, I hope you will always stand for the school fight song. If you are wearing them, throw your caps during the yay ra, and try not to injure anyone or break anything if you are doing this at home. Thank you for being such a gracious audience. Please begin the recessional.